Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the Abaddon Silo in Oxygen Not Included, where the dupes today are actually trying to get to this water, hopefully. We really need it. <laughs> um, thankfully, that dig stays there, even if sand drops into it. I think that might be a... Um, something that was patched. Okay, what did we just finish um decor which is good because we're about to set up our farms uh we could um get power i think i want to get gas piping here so and the reason being is that i do want to start getting the vents in the walls to push carbon dioxide towards the sun oh gosh it's getting really bad down there isn't it <laughs> That's a vacuum, so that's pretty good. I think we'll build down to that. Uh, we'll bust into it. I might change how this is set up a little bit later, but I think that would be good. Now, I don't know if there's actually anything that we can do with chlorine. Um, and that's kind of a thing, because chlorine... There is quite a bit of chlorine, and bleachstone makes chlorine and stuff like that, so... Um, yeah, I just, we, we got to figure something to do with it if it can't be, uh, like, pump it into another room or something. But, anywho, all the dupes are going to sleep for the time being. Uh, is that algae? That is algae. We can, we can dig up the algae. Um, I won't be too hurt if they did. In fact, I kind of want them to. <laughs> um, in fact, somebody can harvest that. Uh, that way we get a little more food. And speaking of food, where is food? Um, yep, uh, there's the algae terrarium, which we're going to have to put up. Oh, here we go. Planter boxes. Um, and we'll actually just... Put them all along here. Um, yeah. Uh, we do need to bust into this, though, so I do need that done, like, now. We do need water. Because we can't do any of the advanced research, first of all, without water. So... Oh gosh, the uh, carbon dioxide is getting really bad too, isn't it? Um, yeah, it is. Uh, we need to set up some at least temporary terrariums, I think. So let's actually do that. One over there, one over there. Uh, prior prioritize those as nine, but we do need the water before those can even function, so... Uh, but we just need the carbon dioxide filtered. Uh, oh, are we barely breathable in general? Yeah, we're barely breathable in general. Okay, so... Um, that's a problem. It means that we need the deoxidizers because that would give us more oxygen. This is a vacuum, isn't it? Yes, so it will suck some of the carbon dioxide out. Um... If we could also have those on a priority, uh, actually nine. We want them running at all times at the moment. Um, I'll reduce it when uh, it becomes necessary, but but yeah, there's so much oxygen in the base right now. It's uh, quite dire that those get up and going. They need water at the moment, right? Yeah, so we need to finish that. There we go. We got some water, which means that we should get these going. And as well as the research. And there we go. Immediately. So much better. Um, but those are temporary. We will be having sources lower in which we will actually have pumps. Actually, yeah, that's how it, it'll work is that... The carbon dioxide will fall, it'll go into algae terrariums, which will release oxygen, which will go up the side, and then a pump at the top 
will push it out. So basically, we're going to be sucking all of the air down, literally, um, all of the air down. So if there's any carbon dioxide, it will come down here kind of thing. But uh, we're going to have to... Wow, we already have 27 mealwood seeds? Holy cow. Uh, let's put those... Wow, this is very m monotonous. Uh, very hands-on. But you have to... Uh, no, not the dupe. The planter. Um, and then let's sweep up all of this. When you can. Um, but yeah, the oxygen is looking actually a lot better. It's just not very breathable. So we do need one of the deoxidizers. We're, we'll put it right here. Uh, priority nine. <laughs> because we need to pressurize the base just in general. So that is a must at the moment. Let's get this algae. Because that's the real problem here is that there's not a lot of oxygen in the base in general. So we need something to start um, pressurizing the base. So, um, not just having oxygen, but having enough pressure that it pushes this carbon dioxide down as well. Oh gosh, that might help if it had power. And can we have that as a nine? This, it's, okay, that's not even working, so it's not even going to function. Oh, that doesn't even have a priority. Hmm, that's interesting. It just all oh, it it just tries to always make it run. But yeah, we just need a lot of oxygen at the moment, so that's our real problem. We want to wait until those are dug out. Um, we actually do want to kind of keep everything swept if we can too to uh, reduce stress where we can. Uh, we can have another dupe, but unless it's someone incredibly good, which we want a vomiter too, so that we don't get anything destroyed. Um, uh, no. Creativity is eight, but we have a artist who can do stuff, so. Nope, not right now. Um, oh, there's actually a lot of algae in there, too. Uh, can we get all that as well? Um, yeah, they can dig all the way up to there if we do that. Um, and since we're not really doing much, can we just, like, start sweeping up everything? Uh, but that should be a... L Oop, I did not mean that. Nope. <laughs> but that should be a lot better. But see how the carbon dioxide is in here? Oh, also, uh, atmospheric pressure is too low. And it's stifled. Hmm. That's interesting. Um, but the carbon dioxide should be falling. So. And that vacuum just sucked all that carbon dioxide in. So that's good. We have this pressurizing the atmosphere quite nicely. Uh, we, there's a bit of contaminated oxygen floating around, probably from this. Um, in which we don't have a way to necessarily catch it at the moment. We'll put a block there, and we don't have the... Uh, we don't actually have the... Um, oh, we finished that, too. Let's get the sanitation sciences because we do need the air cleaner so okay so now what do we need we were going to make I think I decided we're going to make over here something we're going to make over here something I can't remember what over here was going to be food that we're going to have um tables down here Let's pause it for a second and go through our stuff and see what we have So that we're going to need. The electrolyzers will actually be, I don't know, somewhere around here. Air deodorizers we do need. Uh, we have the battery, power switch, food, cooking stations, hydrofans. We 
do want to start actually setting up where the terrarium's going to go because we're almost at the level. But first, we need the dining room and stuff. That's going to go wherever the fridge is going to be. Um, actually, we can have that right here, the dining stuff. In fact, let's do that. Let's have four dining tables and let them go and get that done. Um, hmm, well, I do think think it's about time that we get into our water tanks, uh, which will actually be right here, I think. Not terribly big, but uh, we want tiled off. I think, yeah, we'll make it five deep, five wide. Just like that. And that will be one. So and then we pull this up like this. And these will be water tanks in which we pull from. So one, two, three, four, five across. One, two, three, four, five across and up. And we will have ladders on both sides for the time being, if not permanently maybe. We'll see. Because uh, we might need to put stuff in the walls on this side and so those ladders would help. And then all of this needs to be dug out. Anywhere that has not been yet needs to be. And in fact, we can actually have a crossing platform right there. Okay, guys, get to it. Um, We might need another dupe just to put someone on this uh, wheel consistently. Um, we do have th this little poof. And a couple more down here that we could possibly use. Um, so what we might do is the little pump that I said that we're going to have over here. We might actually have a thing that cycles uh, any contaminated. Because like I said, the oxygen in the base is actually going to be cycling. That we're going to make it so that all of it gets sucked in down here um, through the algae farm. So that any carbon dioxide gets pulled down and pushed out of every room. And uh, but we can have the contaminated oxygen actually just put into uh, a room where these guys are. So that might be actually a thing. And then we'll have a pump in the room where those guys are. In which we'll uh, siphon out oxygen only. So it'll have kind of a loop with a filter on it. I kind of like that idea. So, let's see here. What is the research done? Oh, oops, <laughs> my mistake. Uh, always do it if it's if you can. Um, yeah, there's a little bit lacking of oxygen at that point. Our algae terrarium is going to be about right here, but oh yeah, as well. Power. Wait, is it decor? It is. Ceiling lamps. We want... Um, do they need to be completely in light? Um, if that's so, then we would need one there, there, there. And that's a little inefficient, but that'll work. Uh, we do need to extend this out. As well as, I'm giving them just tons of jobs again. <laughs> They're not going to get any of this done quickly. Um, we'll extend that over. Um, and up the ladder? No. I don't want it up the ladder. I want it through the walls, technically. Um... That's not an option right now, so for now we'll just connect it like that. And we do need to actually connect it here, here, and here. Um, that being said, a four high room would help out quite a bit. So, and the, um, and the algae farms do need to be next here on the list of stuff. Oh gosh, we have no food. 
My apologies, I did not see that we had no food. <laughs> I do apologize, dupes. Um, let's uh, get someone on cooking and make that a nine. It's mandatory. Someone needs to be on it. Um, it has water now. Somebody start making food. These just haven't grown in yet, too, is part of the problem, so... Um, we would we should actually just dig all of this out. But let's say that this is a lower priority. We want this done later. So, as nice as all of that is, we don't. N oh, actually, this one we do. Uh, but the rest of it we don't really need right now. So, um, let's see what else. We have our water tanks being made, but very slowly. Um, hmm. Oh, and this, uh, the idea of this base will be trying to make a completely self-sufficient. That's why we're going to utilize the poofs. Uh, we will try to corral them into an area probably over here that we'll have, um, unless we have, do we have poofs over here at all? I can't see any. Uh, we will try to make two, but these three are on the side, so I'm not going to try to do anything that isn't easy. So, Or that is more trouble than it's worth kind of thing. So, um, let's ins How much do we have? Uh, we have a decent amount of algae, but it is running a little low. Let's uh, get all of this. And this. Oh, we still have some algae that we need to get up there. So we need to actually cancel this. Otherwise, they won't be able to reach it. Um, They do have some food now. Not a lot, but there's some. And work has significantly slowed down because of it. Um, It's just really hard for everything to keep up. It's getting there in the breathability. Uh, it's not super high yet though and nighttime um are you done eating thank you <laughs> once this harvest starts to get in i think we'll be a lot better but until then um i do believe that um do the arrows mean priority Nope, 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 I did not. Can I, can I turn that off? Oh, that's who's good at digging. Okay, um, just everyone. That's what I want it on. Uh, okay, so that's what that does. Very good, that's good to know. Um, wow, we're not pooping a lot. <laughs> we don't have we actually don't have any compost going uh oh that's right do we have the deodorizers yet no we don't we're actually researching that now in fact now we do um actually is it just me or is the that's interesting they clean the air themselves they've breathed in the contaminated oxygen breathed out carbon dioxide there's less contaminated oxygen in here than there was. So that's interesting. Um, we do have the hand sanitizer now. and We do have some of that stuff. We do need the water tanks done before we can do much else, though. Um, why would you run all the way down there if you needed to use the toilet? Like, if you're getting close, you should just use it. You know, it's not helping anyone for you not to use it. <laughs> um, but they, we almost have all the lights going, so that should be really good. Any details? Nope. Thermal capa cap. Uh, was that capacity or captivity? Conductivity. Okay. I don't believe we're gonna take anyone unless they're awesome. Narcoleptic. Can't dig it. Eh, nope. 
nothing really good there. And it is really good to be highly, highly selective of your dupes. Don't just take anyone. You need to take specific people. Uh, we will reprioritize that to fives. Um, oh, yeah, that's right. We finished the research. What do we need next? I do believe we need the water purifier with how we're going. Let's take a look for a second. Cook station, fertilizer maker, refrigerator. We don't necessarily need those at the moment. We do need to get up into the coal generator and hydrogen generator so we can get little rid of the hamster wheel, though. So we'll go with uh, power regulation. Um, this thing is just burning away, which is good because we do need more pressure in the base. Um, just, yeah, just we need stuff done, though. <laughs> Maybe we'll make this, like, the lavatories and stuff like that. Uh, we'll make down here the pipe exchange for them. Because I'm not sure we're going to need actually a full thing of storage right there. So. Oh, wow. Another cycle is done. These cycles are going by really quick. Uh, we do need to dig that. Because they can't get over there. Um... Come on, dupes. Sleep it up. Let's get back to work. I need a, I need a whip. Like, just... Whoosh. It's time to wake up. Um, Yeah, see, someone's always on that hamster wheel at the moment. Just, this is a lot of light, too. <laughs> Although, she does charge it. So, it's we're not having issues yet. Actually, that makes me think. We need the coal generators next, to be fair. Not the... Uh, um... Oh, we have the manual air locks now, which is actually what we want on these, but we want to dig it out first. Ah! Clicking the wrong things. <laughs> Why are they pro process or prioritizing that storage over this storage? That's weird. Um. Anywho. We are getting up in food again. I think... Just the, oh, oops, uh, just the one, we'll, oh, okay, this is irritating, we'll do the one more mush bar, we will get that out, and then hopefully these will be harvestable by then, in fact, someone harvest this, oh, those are harvestable, just harvest anything that's harvestable down there, we want it done, we want it done now, and then we'll actually configure it to do lice loaf. Whenever we get lice down or lice meal down here, they'll immediately try to change it into lice loaf. So, um, oof, that's never a good task to have to do, but someone has to do it. So, um, skill increase. Elvis now has a learning of three. Very nice. The research, yeah, this is idle, but we are doing stuff still, so. Uh, jobs, let's ensure that everybody's doing what they're best at. Um, I want everyone to deliver, technically, right here. Digging, though, um, gosh, both of the people that are terrible at digging are also terrible at building. I'm not sure what to do about that. <laughs> it's just kind of loot. Kind of a lose-lose situation there. Um, why is there dirt all across here? Sweep that up, please. Um, there's always something to do, so... And they're not getting to any of this anywhere quickly. Um, which is kind of a problem. Uh, but they should be able to clean that up really quick, just because. Oh, we got power, which allows us the big batteries. Um, so, let's choose the research. Let's get the combustion station, because we actually want to put in the coal station. Um, rather sharpish. Um...
Mm. Sorry about that. My throat got really tickly for a second there. Uh, we do want... How big are these um, coal generators? I cannot actually see. Um, I do believe they are 3x3, three three, though, so we'll plan accordingly. 3x3. Three three. And this actually makes a very good kind of stepped area to be able to have the algae farms kind of thing. Um, because I do only want like an itty bitty outlet for these generators and for them to be just off to the side. I don't know where my dupes are at the moment, but I'm guessing doing something. <coughs> Gosh, tickly throats are the worst, aren't they? Anywho, we have quite a bit of uh, compost in there. Um, that contaminated dirt's going down really fast, though. Uh, do these use fertilizer? Let's actually... Can I... Was there a way to actually see? Um, because if we don't need fertilizer, I'd rather not have it. Uh, can we... These cannot be prioritized. I have to manually harvest them, which kind of sucks. Okay, uh, let's do this, though. If there is any lice meal, make it into lice loaf. And then we will harvest. Um, at that, we should actually get some pretty good food going here. Um, that's not lice loaf. Why are, are you, are you making mush bars? Because that's... That does, that does, um, my good sir, that does, I can't not tell if these are lice, oh, they are lice loaf, oh, okay. Okay, so they are actually making lice loaf there, and I can actually leave these unharvested. So, if we need more food, I'll just harvest a couple of them, and then, uh, yeah, they'll be good. So, but at that, let's let them work for a while because, oh, the stress is going up a little. Which means that we do start need to start getting some decor around the place. Um, we'll get some decor right there. We can't really do much right there, but um, definitely above the tables, I would think. Uh, we'll get three. And then above the beds, we'll get two. Okay, get it done. And it's time for sleep. The days just go by too fast, it almost seems like. They don't get much done. <laughs> um, like, they haven't really dug anything out. And it kind of bothers me. I would think that they would need to be bugging or bugging that they would need to be uh, um they're grabbing a lot of water all the time for something probably that lice loaf and they did get the algae up and going there we go they're starting on the pictures which is good and a lot of bottled water into this which we needed for the research um yep just Getting all those paintings done, trying to make the place look better. Um, there's one done. Things are starting to slow down quite a bit, which means I think we need more um, people. Uh, we'll prep a couple more beds. We'll dig out the roof so that it's nice. Oh gosh, that's going to be a problem. Because it's going to fall and there's no dig orders down that far. <laughs> um, we have another research done. Oh, all the way up to combustion. Okay. Uh, we advanced filtration. The liquid filter. Technically, right now, there's only two liquids. Contaminated and non-contaminated water. Which, I get why you would still need a filtration system for it. But, um, let us... to maintain ideal liquid pressure. That's interesting. 
What does that mean exactly? Increase or decrease um, liquid volume in pipes to main ideal liquid pressure. So basically, we can manage how much water goes into our water tanks. We put it at the very bottom, and we regulate the pressure until uh, it's at the point in which we want it to be. Hmm, I like that. Or at least that's what it makes it sound like. I think we'll go for that next. But that is the end of the episode. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, please do leave a like if you did as it does help the channel and do subscribe if you're not already to catch the next episode as it comes out if you have any comments questions or suggestions mona lisa yeah masterpieces uh please leave those in the comment section below and i will see you guys next time thank you for watching and have a good one goodbye